Hi everyone, NJ here. In today's video tutorial, I will show you how to make this bear and panda appliques uh, perfect to sew on a blanket or you can sew them on your head as I did with mine. Uh, if you want to see more tutorials like this one, make sure to subscribe to our channel. Uh, for this tutorial, I am using a 4.5 mm crochet hook. You will need a pair of safety eyes. Um, 8 or 10 millimeter safety eyes is okay and worsted weight yarn I'm using Bernard premium yarn but you can use whatever have uh, whatever yarn you have in your stash let's get start with the pattern itself we are start we are starting the the applique by making the the head for this grab your yarn and your hook start with a magic ring chain one and make 11 double crochet into the ring Close your ring, and join with slip stitch into the into the chain one we've made in the beginning. Chain two, and make one double crochet into the base of initial chain two. The initial chain 2 is counted as a double crochet throughout the pattern. Continue making 2 double crochet into each stitch till the end. When you reach the end, join with slip stitch on top into the uh, join with slip stitch into the second chain of, of initial chain 2. 1 2 into the second chain. chain 2 again and make 2 double crochet into the next stitch then we will repeat the sequence uh, 1 double crochet into the next stitch and 2 double crochet into the second stitch Repeat this till the end, 1 double crochet, then 2 double crochet into the second stitch. When you finish around 3, join with slip stitch into the second chain of initial chain 2. Fasten off. This will be the face and the head. Take your light brown color. We are making the muzzle now. Start with a magic ring. Chain 1 and make 12 double crochet into the ring. Close the ring and join with slip stitch again into the chain 1. Cut your yarn and leave a longer tail for sewing. And let's make the ears. Take your brown color and let's make the ears. Uh, you just need to repeat the same as we did for the muzzle. I have made my ears before the video.
And now let's make the nose. Take a piece of black color yarn and a tapestry needle. Insert your tapestry needle in the middle center of the magic ring from back to front and then insert it back on insert it back on one so one of the stitches on the top of one of the stitches then back to the center and now on top of one of the stitches one two lift two and then on to the third one to form a triangle repeat this till you feel the triangle for the nose Then go on to the next side and make a straight line to form the triangle better, the nose better. Make it twice. Then go back into the middle. and make a straight line downwards. Secure with a tie or with a knot. And your nose is done. Take your pieces and let me show you how to put them together. Take your muzzle and a tapestry needle and sew it on, onto, the top, onto the bottom of the face. Uh, I would like to onto the seam so it will be invisible. Take your safety eyes and insert them right onto the on uh, right above the muzzle. Leave three stitches between them. Take your ears. and sew them on both sides from behind, like that. Then 
you can make a straight line like that so you will know how to place them with the eye Repeat the same for the second ear and you will have your applique done. Now for the panda, uh, on the only difference between the bear and the panda are the eye patches. So let me show you how to make the eye patches. I will use brown again as it uh, with black color it's not visible. Start with a magic ring and make seven, double cro seven half double crochet into the ring. One, two, seven, close your ring and just chain one. Don't join your ring as we want it to be a semicircle. Here is a previous panda applique that I made, and now I will show it. Sew the muzzle on the bottom again, then place your safety eye into the middle of the eye patch and sew the eye patch above the muzzle. And this is how it will look. Uh, so if you like this video tutorial, make sure to subscribe to our channel and ring the bell button so you have an, uh, you will get a notification whenever we have a new video tutorial for you. Uh, thanks for watching, see you in the next video.